Hi, Tim Biggin for Delta Derivatives, Option Hedges and Edges, taking a look at a market that is on hold in front of the uh, long-awaited Fed meeting tomorrow. I think 25 basis point cut all but baked into the market here. Anything different than that may actually be bad for the market. I think they'll obviously talk that the economy still is strong, but leave open uh, the big time chance for another cut come December. So I think it might be two rate cuts and done here for the Fed, then wait and see. So market, I think, will continue to kind of chop around here. I think Boyd did the downside by, you know, ultra cheap interest rates. Boyd did the upside by rather historically expensive valuation. So until we get into earnings season in, uh, you know, a few weeks or so, I think this market will just kind of drift aimlessly here. I think the reaction we saw out of oil yesterday with oil, you know, ripping up higher. And the market kind of yawning, and today with oil giving up a lot of those gains on the fact that uh, Saudi will be repairing the oil fields a lot faster than what they had talked about. The market kind of yawning as well. So I think the yawn will uh, continue for the foreseeable future. Something that didn't yawn yesterday was Toll Brother call options saw enormous volume in the October 41 calls, over 25,000 traded versus just 11 open interest. Toll finally broke out to the upside past that 39 level had been one of the you know, laggards as far as the housing stocks here. Raced all the way up above 41 before ultimately reversing by about a point here. So uh, more importantly, that implied vow on those OC 41 calls jumped from under 25 to over 30 because that big call buyer, even with the stock going up, normally, as we know, implied volatility tends to get a little bit lower on an up move in stock. So I jumped in, followed along with that call buyer, but in a different way, bought the shares, sold those comparatively expensive OC 41 calls here, uh, you know, paying about 39.40 net on that. I'm about 50 deltas net long. These are kind of at the money calls. So have about half the risk of buying the stock outright and about the same as buying the calls outright here. But if we just sit here and stagnate, I make money as a function of time. More importantly, I capture that big vow pump as well. Otherwise, uh, really just kind of seeing the market drift around here, I still kind of favor those uh, stocks that have a decent yield with decent growth. Uh, they've pulled back a little here recently, so I like buying those, selling a covered call on top of it. If I can, uh, you know, double the yield on the 10-year with uh, not much risk, I kind of like that trade. So we'll see what the Fed does. Until then, dead to the Fed. Until next time, as always, here's the good trading. Take care.